you're back on Inside Action, coming to you today from Brooklyn, New York, and the New York City Food Waste Fair, where Action Environmental Group has a presence. And I'm joined by Nikki Capazell, who's running the show here for Action Carding. And we just want to know what this event's all about. So the city with the new uh, recycling laws, uh, composting is one of the big things that they're pushing. So we're out here educating everybody about composting and organic waste recycling. So we're just kind of meeting residents and businesses to kind of let them know what we do. Tell us about this event. I know it's a first time and to me it looks like the turnout is fantastic and there's a lot of education going on here. Absolutely. So we wanted to make sure that we were reaching out across the different business communities about our goals for making sure that we are either reusing or reducing or composting our organic waste. And there are a lot of tools out there from action as the carding company to uh, equipment that you might need to materials on tracking it for software purposes. There are over 60 booths today at the fair and we're also doing workshops all day long. Uh, to provide education not only on how to do it well but also what the enforcement and rules are around it. As you guys know from Action, starting next Tuesday, August 1st, the new uh, DSNY BIC composting and, and recycling rules um, go into effect in terms of issuing violations. Of course, the focus isn't to issue as many violations as we can, but really work with the carters and with the business generators um, to make it work. And as far as events like this go, I mean, it's great to get all of these people with like minds together uh, in the same room because relationships develop and business develops and I think innovation occurs when you have people uh, from different types of organizations taking different angles on the same problems, no? I agree 100%. This is a relationship-based business, whether it's the regulator and the regulated, whether it's the customer and the company, and it's in places like this where you can build relationships, strengthen them, perhaps bring in new business, and learn from each other. Action and I go way back. Uh, I've been helping Action for uh, more than a decade. It's a great company, a uh, very progressive uh, carding company, environmental services company, and uh, look forward to a long and productive relationship uh, with the entire team. I'm a sustainability consultant. We work for Eco Evolutions, and we are based in Central Jersey. And we have a lot of clients who like to do uh, zero waste, and we're just trying to learn more about what services are available to them. When you compose it, you can convert compost into soil, you can convert compost into energy. So what we're trying to do is just sending these compost to places that it can be converted into energy, so that way it supplies energy to different places. The major hurt hurdle with the organic composting is where to bring it to. No one wants that in their backyard because the odors that emanate from that material is just overbearing, so uh, that's a big, big obstacle, and I think uh, we're in the stages of figuring out a solution for that. Well, I, I think this is a great example of uh, public-private partnership. I mean, obviously, the whole composting food waste issue has been a huge problem for the city. But action's on top of it. Action's always on top of it. <laughs> we try to do our best. And that is Inside Action.